Hi, in this video we're going to be talking about a new feature for the Windows Snipping Tool. So coming up shortly here you will be able to create animated GIFs uh, from your screen captures. So as you probably know you could record video with the Snipping Tool as of now, but they're coming out with this new feature. So for now it's only available on the Windows 11 Insider Editions on the Dev and Canary channels, but it should be available to everyone soon. Alright, so if we open the Snipping Tool, We go to the three dots here in settings. You can see here's our build right here. So you have to have at least 11.2505.21.0 to have this feature. So how you use it, you just do the regular video setting. So we're going to open up a video here. Then once you're on the video record setting here, press new. And then draw your box around what you want to record. I believe this video is right here in the middle, so we'll do it like this. Click on Start. You get a little countdown. All right, so we're just going to record the dog doing some backflips here. All right, then we'll stop it. And now one thing you might run across is the video quality being washed out like this so I'm not sure why this is happening I'm doing this on a virtual machine so it's not my actual physical computer so that might be the reason I've also read that it could be an HDR setting in Windows that you can try disabling and some other things so you'll have to see if you get this problem as well so right now we just have the regular video but if we want to do the animated GIF option here just expand this a little you'll see you'll have this new GIF button here so click on that then decide if you want lower high quality size it'll just change the frame rate here from 12 to 24 click on export give it a name where you want to put it you see it saves it as a GIF file here alright so now we'll double click it open it in Windows Photos now you can see we have a GIF image file here. It's not a video file, it's actually an image file. And then you can do whatever you want with it. But obviously if you're going to have this color problem, it's not going to work out for you. So you'll have to see how it works for you when you try it on your physical computer compared to a virtual machine here. Alright, so if you are on one of these Windows builds and you're still not getting it, you could go to the Microsoft Store app. If you click on the library here, you may have a button to do an update. Or you could search for a snipping tool. This is how I updated it. Did a search for it, brought it up, and then I had an update button here to actually update it to that version. So you could try both ways because if you go to the library, you're supposed to have an update apps button up here somewhere. But it doesn't seem to be there. And if you scroll down to snipping tool on the list, there's no update option for it either. And then one other thing I'm going to show you that I noticed is new on the snipping tool here. So we have this color picker option. So if you do new, click on that, you could have hex, RGB, or HSL. Then you just click where you want it, and it gives you a code for that color. And when you click on it, it copies it to the clipboard, and then you could paste it in, you know, your photo editing app or whatever you're doing to get that exact color. So that's just some nice little feature that's part of the snipping tool as well. All right, so once again, just make sure you're on the Canary or Dev version of the Windows Insider for now, depending on when you're watching this. You may already have this. And then like I said too, just make sure you have this version of the snipping tool right here or higher. And then you'll have the animated GIF feature. Alright, thanks for watching. Be sure to subscribe.